Hey, I'm Joe with Inch Calculator, and in this video we're going to talk about how to convert millimeters to inches and inches to millimeters. Stay tuned and I'll also show you a really useful tool to make these conversions much easier. Let's get started. Inches are a US customary and imperial unit of measure and we use them for measuring length in the United States. Inch measurements are usually denoted with the letters IN or sometimes by using a quotation mark. Millimeters are an SI metric unit of measure equal to one thousandth of a meter. They're occasionally used to measure length in the US and pretty much everywhere else in the world. Millimeter measurements are denoted with the letters MM. Before we go into some examples of how to convert millimeters to inches, we need to talk about the conversion ratio. There are 25.4 millimeters in one inch, which we call the conversion ratio, or the rate of millimeters per inch. To convert inches to millimeters, you will multiply the measurement in inches by 25.4, since there are 25.4 millimeters per inch. To convert millimeters back to inches, you'll divide the measurement by 25.4. So, to go from a larger to a smaller unit, you multiply, and to go from a smaller to a larger unit, you divide. Let's try some examples to demonstrate how this works. Let's look at how to convert 3 inches to millimeters. To get the answer, multiply the length in inches by 25.4. So, 3 inches times 25.4 is equal to 76.2 millimeters. You may need to use a calculator for some of these conversions. Let's try another example and convert 12 inches into millimeters. Just like before, multiply the inch measurement by 25.4. 12 times 25.4 is equal to 304.8. So 12 inches is equal to 304.8 millimeters. Feel free to drop any questions you might have in the comments below. And don't forget to like this video, it helps us out a lot. Now let's look at how to convert millimeters into inches. To convert millimeters to inches, you'll divide the millimeters by 25.4 instead of multiplying. Let's try converting 95 millimeters into inches. Start by dividing 95 by 25.4, which is equal to 3.74. So, 95 millimeters is equal to 3.74 inches, or just about 3 and 3 quarters of an inch. Let's try another example and convert 230 millimeters into inches. Like before, let's divide 230 millimeters by 25.4, which is equal to 9.06 inches. So, 230 millimeters is equal to 9.06 inches. If you ever forget the conversion ratio of 25.4 millimeters per inch, or if you don't have a calculator handy, you can always use our feet and inches calculator to do millimeter to inch conversions like this. I'll add a link to that along with some other useful resources in the description below. Check them out if you think it'd be helpful. And one final note, when you're working with millimeters, you might also see it spelled with an RE instead of an ER like this. This is actually the official spelling and is frequently used outside of the US. And that's how you convert millimeters to inches and inches to millimeters. We hope this helped you out. If it did, please like this video to help others learn about it too.